Hi, everybody. This is Amber of the Evergrande Basic Bees. And um, I battled Jacob. So that's this battle for week nine. And um, yeah, so let's get right down into this. <sighs> I didn't get to plan much for this battle. And also this was like two weeks ago. So he started with Smeargle. So I started with Mega Sableye. Cause so I was like, yo, he's gonna try to do some tricky shit. I'm gonna use Taunt. But then he used Nuzzle, which is an attacking move that automatically paralyzes. Didn't really know about that move beforehand. I just assumed he would go for like a sticky web or something. But he switches out and then goes for Nimbus, obviously, because fairy. Um, so... Then, um... Uh, I'm paralyzed. I can't do anything. <sighs> so sad. Oh, but that switch was just a lure and he immediately switched out. I was afraid of the fairy move, though. So I got out. And uh, I brought in a Moongus. I'm gonna eat it. And he just, you know, sets up a reflect. Which, yeah, that's, I guess, fair. But I just go for that Spore. I don't think he brought any grass types this week, if I'm remembering correctly. So I was, like, free to do a Spore whenever. Um, and he gets out of there. He set up that reflect, so he's pretty safe there. And then there's the Tornadus. I like. <sighs> Sorry, might not have been nothing, apparently. Uh, so that Sludge Bomb did actually way more than I would have anticipated, especially with a Reflect Up. Not that I could ever tell you like what moves are special and which ones are physical and what, like whatever. Um, blah blah blah. Anyway, he kind of anticipated that I would switch out to, you know. And he, he got a mega huge hit on my Toxpex, which kind of sucked. And then I was anticipating another, like, psychic move, so I switched in Sableye, but he kind of saw through that and used Thunderbolt. And I lose Mega Sableye. So that kind of sucked. Um, he really, like, predicted well and stuff, um, which... I expect from Jacob, but, you know, it's just, like, constantly being outplayed. <laughs> uh, so, then I lose Quagsire, which fucking sucks. But that had to have been him power grass, like, Quagsire is super weak to grass, super allergic. And, uh, so, Jacob was a little nervous about the Pacinian. Rightfully so. He's he's good. He's a good boy. Molo Zabumafu. Um, I have it as a girl though. She a good girl. Such a girl. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, you know these switches to try to counter. Um, wow, Mega Altaria. Such an interesting Pokemon. I think it's shiny too, because I'm pretty sure my Altaria is typically blue. Bleh bleh bleh. Stupid support moves. Waking up you is fine. Ooh, Amoongus kinda tanks that, and then I answer with a sludge bomb, and super effective, but not enough, but then I get the poison. Dude, Amoongus got so many poisons with the sludge bomb this week. It was kind of actually really hilarious. Um, <sighs> Jacob just let him die, but I mean, that's fair. Because, like, you get a free switch in, and, like, 
I, I mean, Sableye was already gone, so there's not much that Altaria was needed for at that point. Um, so Mew just gets to set up those screens again, and uh, I don't really do much to him. Uh, so, yeah, more screens. Now we got a screen for both physical and special. And um, so my noobs really don't do anything. But I get the toxic poisons, which are which is nice. Uh, even though that's synchronized, obviously it doesn't affect me because I'm poison type. So that's super helpful. Um, I just get that chip damage. But then, you know, he just gets out of there. Totally fine. God, I'm so fucking tired all the time. My stupid job. Alright. Um, and then, so, I believe this is where he actually finally does get that sticky web up, which, meh. He needed the sticky web, though, because Pissimian outsped, um, so he needed the sticky web to make sure that he could run through my team at that point, which kind of does end up happening. But that's okay. So, yeah, this fucking lunar dance. Tornadoes was so low. So low. Ugh. This just makes me so sad. Because, look at him. Just a sliver. Just a sliver of health left. That's it. I could have taken that out. Because Tornadus was really, like, the scariest thing on the team. Because, like, obviously all those moves super affect me. And then it's just, alright, bye. Bye, eat it. Love you. Little mushroom face. And, like, I, what do I do now? I have Sturdy, that's cool. Like, yeah, fuck yeah, okay, okay. And I get him out of there, but that's like all I can really do. Like, there's nothing I could have like KO'd him with. And then like, obviously that's faster, especially in like Sticky Web. So then, Skarmory is down. Light screen wore off. Now I have Tox Packs, but uh, pretty sure this thing learns Psychic, or no, it just uses Tablo. What is Tablo? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, so he boosts up, sorry, like I said, this was like two weeks ago. Um, <laughs> so yeah, this is why he needed like the Sticky Wet, because now this Pokemon, which I'm blanking on the name of, speeds, like, outspeeds my team. He was able to set up, and now he can just run through. Like, absolutely just run through. Because Pissimian could have KO'd, because I would typically outspeed with, because I have Choice Scarf on it. Um, but not this time. I mean, that's cool, like, my attack rose, but obviously this outspeeds and Psychic KOs me. Um... So that was kind of irritating. Uh, I wish maybe, I guess, instead of going for the Whirlwind, I should have gone for the Defog to get rid of the Sticky Web. Um, but he could have always just brought in um, Smeargle again, because it's not like I KO'd Smeargle, got rid of the threat. So I guess that's the one thing that I could have done differently. I'm not sure if it really would have made a difference in the long run, but overall, good battle. I actually, you know, didn't lose 6-0 for once, so that's pretty nice, like, again, shake up. <laughs> so, all right, cool. Well, I will see you guys next week, maybe, if I'm doing the commentary. I face Zach. Gotta look forward to that Tapu Lele. Oh boy.